Hi everyone and welcome to another trading video. I'm your market analyst Adam Carberg. Today we are going to be having a look at the gold chart or the price action on gold for recently. So we're going to start having a look by having a look at the weekly chart action on gold. Um, and what we can see is that, oops that's the wrong one, just bear with me. What we've seen is that Leading up to the start of 2020, we've kind of been in a long period of consolidation. As we just zoom out a little bit, we're kind of in this yet yeah, very long period of consolidation before, of course, COVID-19 pandemic happened and we saw this nice big jump up. Since then, we've had a peak at $2,080 and we kind of reached that again in um, early this year, just on the onset of the um, Russian-Ukraine crisis. So as we can see, we've got these two peaks. And the price wasn't really able to um, get above this level here for whatever reason. Um, you know, the buyers, the sellers, uh, sorry, there was some support found at this point. And since then, we've kind of been, um, we've been consolidating just above, you know, 16, 1700. So as we have a look at the daily chart, what we can see is, a similar sort of pattern emerging um, where we've got these kind of two peaks um, and this period of consolidation. So I suppose the next step forward is, well, what's gold going to do? Is it going to come back down, retest this support at 1500? Um, and that's a very possible outcome. You know, we weren't able to break through. So maybe we're going to come down here, perhaps bounce back up, come back and go sideways for a period of time. Or are we going to hold this level and bounce back up to the long side? You know, maybe we go, maybe we're going to find some support and we're going to go back up through here. At the moment, it's very hard to know. Um, and it's definitely one where, you know, we want to kind of wait and see a little bit. And I think that's definitely, um, traders and investors have similar thoughts on that at the moment, as we can see, you know, there's a lot of chop, a lot of, um, there's a, there is a little bit of a rounding bottom. Um, which is, you know, potentially a sign that we are going to continue this kind of bullish pattern. Um, and some of the things that may affect this price going forward are things such as inflation. So if for whatever reason inflation decides to slow down or speed up, we may um, we may revisit, you know, potential trading opportunities. 